guys, so it is June 27th. Uh, we are still in Fernie, uh, BC. If you're ever somewhere in your van and uh, you need a place to shower, a good place to go to is uh, their local aquatic center or even health centers. They have pools there. And uh, what you can do is you pay, a, a lot of the times it's just $6. So you paid the $6 and you can use their hot tub and their, or their pool. So we use their hot tub since it was rest day and uh, just, you know, relax our muscles and everything. And then um, we went and just used their showers. So I was able to like wash my hair and shave and everything. So that was good. Um, we do have our shower here. It works, it works pretty well. Um, Matt's just gone into Canadian Tire because uh, our uh, shower head doesn't have much pressure on it. So uh, we're going to see if we can get a new one and then this way we can shower more. Also um, another place you can go to if you're wanting to find have a shower is uh, local gyms in whatever town you're in. Um, you know just buy a day pass and you can work out if you want or if not then don't. Uh, and then you can just go and use their shower so that's always good too or you can, you can always bird bath it you know, just right out of the sink or something like that. Um, another th helpful thing we got, if we just need to like freshen up like in the morning or uh, after a bike ride or anything, because we don't want to take like too many showers in a day um, and waste water. Though we're kind of getting water for free, well, $2 for water um, at uh, the visitor center uh, in Fernie here. So they actually have a dumping uh, area and where you and, it, and you, it's two bucks and then you can fill up your water too so we've been filling up our water f for that so and we barely use water just for dishes and everything um so yeah so what we'll do just do after a bike ride or um waking up in the morning or something like that just baby wipes honestly i got a pack of 100 baby wipes for like two bucks at super center uh walmart has good deals too also another tip <laughs> is um, we went out and we got a case of water. And the problem is, now I have a bunch of water uh, bottles that we need to recycle. And we can get money back from them in BC, so that's good. Um, but honestly, it's, it's not that great because you're having with all these bottles that are rolling around and trying to find a place to put them. And also, it's not very good for the environment um, you're throwing all these bottles away and everything. So what we did, we're, we're almost done our case of water. So we went out and bought four little liter, four liter jugs of water here. Uh, so we got two. Um, so this way it's just two bottles and when we run out, um, then we can uh, just fill them up with regular water free from wherever and we're all set. And this way it helps so Mac can put it in his, uh, his backpack that he brings up the mountain with it. And then we'll use the actual um, camper water um, for dishes and for showering and everything. Uh, so we just picked up some groceries, just a couple little things that we needed. Um, we need the Pam because, well we don't really do oil so we got like a coconut. Um, coconut oil spray and everything figured it's easier so if you ever come to Fernie um, go to the Fernie Alpine Resort parking lot one has free camping um, so you can park there for free with your RV and then it's a cute little town if you do want to go mountain biking if you don't mountain bike then it's totally fine you just get a free place to, uh, free place to stay there's no hookups or anything but if you get closer to the building you get Wi-Fi so we found a uh, parking spot where a van is level and we reach the Wi-Fi so it's good so we can watch Netflix cook dinner and everything watch Netflix settle down and go to bed after so another quick tip that I forgot to put in the video is uh, if you don't want to waste your electricity um, or uh, if your battery's running low and everything uh, a good thing to get is these little fairy lights I got these last year um, at uh, the Real Canadian Superstore for like two bucks for Christmas and uh, it's I think seven feet of lights and you can just put them right up there and I just basically velcroed the battery box to our the thing above the window ledge the thing above the windows that holds the blinds whatever you call it and uh, honestly it lights up um, our room because we sleep on the 
on the table like when it's folded down so I put one on the other side um, Matt's putting up more right now and they work awesome so there's your last tip hope these tips helped if you have any questions comment down below and I will answer them or Matt will answer them and uh, happy van life and